To adjust your user settings and preferences, hover over the gears and choose user from the menu. The user settings screen contains various user settings and preferences. If you want to change your password, click change password, enter your new password and confirm it and choose save. This will log you out of the client and you'll have to log in with the new password. You'll receive an email notification indicating that your password has been changed. The regional information tab contains time zone, language, currency, and units of measure. These settings affect how information is displayed in the client. The country, state, province, city, and zip postal are optional, but these are used for weather information. On the preferences tab, you have correspondence, general, and available plugins. The correspondence allow you to select or deselect whether or not you're going to receive newsletters and weekly reports. The general settings allow you to choose between dark and light chart themes and whether or not you want to show weather on the home page. Weather will only be shown if you have your locational information set. The available plugins list allows you to select and deselect plugins that are available in your list. If I don't want to show certain plugins, I can uncheck them and they're removed from the list. To show them, I just check them and they're added back in. The contact information page has your primary email address as a requirement. All the other fields are optional. Secondary email, primary phone, and secondary phone can be left blank, but these are used for alert functionality. The alert options tab allows you to configure how and when system alerts will be received. We'll leave these in the default settings for now. If for any reason you want to restore back to the defaults, choose the restore defaults button and all your preferences will be reset. If you want to delete your user account, choose delete user account and this will close the user account. Once you're happy with your settings, choose done and the user settings screen will close.